With your name, Black Sabbath, I suppose a lot of people tend to think of you as practicing black magicians or something. A name means whatever you want to interpret it to be. We like the name Black Sabbath, so we said... We just like the name, you know. Why did you pick the name in the first place? Why did the Beatles pick the Beatles, you know? Nobody knows. So, Ozzy, we're here sitting in your house because of this pandemic that we're in. You're talking about how everyone thought when you were in Black Sabbath with this black magic crew, mm -hmm. and you told me this story of how you went and saw The Exorcist. The manager came up and said, you guys have got to go see this film, The Exorcist. It's unbelievable. Everybody thinks we're the haunted band. And we all crapped ourselves. People got it all wrong. They all thought we were a black magic fucking spooky band. We sung a few things about that, but we did environmental issues or everything that's going on to this day. I mean, so it's like, it's kind of funny when people start doing songs about the pandemic. We were doing that 50 years ago, you know. Everyone sung about boy meets girl, and I like to do something which interests me. How Vietnam was going, uh, the fear of nuclear holocaust. That just blew my mind, I thought, what is going on in this world? What other things do you like? Ice cream. <laughs> it's on the first Black Sabbath album. You just sing on top of your voice, because the, the producer, Roger Bain, says, Nobody matches your voice better than you. You never sing the same line the same twice. So it's kind of like a shadow of my soul. Black Sabbath wasn't a band that was created by some big mogul guy. We were four guys who said, let's have a go, we have a dream, and it came true beyond our wildest expectations. When you're in the eye of a storm, you don't realize it's good or bad. It is. All I was trying to do was survive. It's my ultimate honor to present you with the GQ Man of the Year Lifetime Achievement Award. Thank you for this award. I'm blessed. Thank you. Did you expect a hassle when you got out here? You couldn't write the story. People wouldn't believe it. 